geared into. Are you surprised when you see these voter analysis numbers, the young voters came out heavy for Donald Trump? Yeah, well, young voters can sniff out a fraud. They can sniff out somebody who's chameleon-like. She changes her position according to the prevailing winds. They didn't like that. Many across the country, young students said, for me, a red line also is mass atrocities, is collective punishment, is what I see going on in the Middle East, and I see us as complicit in. So they, you know, were saying, I'm not just enth that enthusiastic, yeah. and I'm not going to get out. I got 15 seconds for you, Steve. I just think when I see this unfold, Trace, it is just a massive victory. Oh, we, we got to oh, jump back. Sense. Sorry, guys, back to you. We got Trump on that. Trace, thank you. The Fox News Decision Desk can now officially project that Donald Trump will become the 47th President of the United States. The former president's comeback will be complete with a win in Wisconsin, a state that he narrowly lost four years ago. He is now the second president in U.S. history to win nine consecutive terms. The first was Grover Cleveland in the late 1800s. Senator J.D. Vance will become the 50th vice president of the United States. Voters express deep frustration with the Biden administration and former President Trump and the future President Trump overperformed in urban areas, particularly with men, proving that the strategy that they doubled and tripled down on over the course of the last few months absolutely succeeded and brought him back to the White House. 47th president of the United States, former President Trump now defeats Vice President Kamala Harris, who entered this race just over 100 days ago. And for Democrats, they were projecting the possibility of running the table with battleground states. Uh, David Plouffe with the Democratic campaign, the Harris campaign, suggested that just yesterday. Now it is possible that Donald Trump runs the table with these states and builds on a big landslide electoral win. We don't know where the popular vote is going to finish out, but we do know that he will be going back to the White House